Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Priyendra Kumar and today I will tell you how can you convert your column chart into a beautiful infographics like this. I have created this graph to this beautiful infographics and these graphs are connected with this data points. If I will change the value, let's say for Monday I am taking as 1500, then the value will be changed as 1500 for this and for this also. So let's start. I'm creating this, copying this table and creating a new worksheet and pasting it here. Now I'm creating this simple Excel chart, column chart. Okay, this one. So this is the chart which is regular uh, in use. So today I will tell you how can create this chart with these data points. So for this. I'm taking some support column here. So I'm taking, let's say, lower cap and upper cap size. So lower cap is this size and the upper cap is this, which is in orange. So now for these data points, I'm taking the, so if I will take the average of these data points it is approximately 1700 or 1800 now if i will make the one fourth of this then it is approximately 436 so uh, for the lower cap and upper cap we will take the size approximately 450 okay so now we will create the chart just select like this data and we will go to the chart and we'll take this stacked column chart and here first of all I will right click on the chart and go to the select data label and we'll arrange the uh, data label data and we will move the upper cap to the upside on the first number okay that's okay now this is our upper side lower side and this is our data so now what we will do we will insert a shape from here and we'll go to the insert and we will go to the under flow chart and we'll take this one which is the flow chart delay click on this and click here the shape has been created now we will make a copy of this and paste it here so now what we will do we will rotate this on rotate left 90 and for this we will rotate as rotate right 90 now we will change the color from here from the shape style so for the upper side we will take this one for this is the lower side so we will take this one and for upper side we are taking this one you can take any other color okay okay so i'm taking this one now we will format the chart so what we will do we will uh, remove all the elements from here and we will right click on this right click on the bar and go to the format data series and from here we will change the gap width as 50 percent now we will go to the format and we will uh, go to the shape fill and select as no fill and similarly for the shape outline as no outline now we will copy this uh, shape and we will paste in the lower side area control b and we will copy this shape and we will paste in upper side area okay friend now what we will do we don't need these shape so we will delete this delete this now here what i will do i'll go to the form format it uh, sorry go to the add data label and click on it add data label similarly for the upper side we will go to the add data label and click on here add data label. now we will format the data label make it bold if you want to change the color as white you can do that now right click on the format data label right click on the data label and go to the format data label and here we will go to this 
so we will click on value from sale and now we will select the range and we will take the range from this which is the actual value of sales so like this click ok now just remove the value from the sales ok friends close this now what we will do in the lower side tab we will click on the data label and uh, right click and go to the format data label uh, format data label and again we will go to the value from sales and now this time we will select this day's name and click ok and remove the value from here now make the font as bold so your graph is ready now we will give the 3d facts picture effect for this graph for that I will move this chart on the left side we can put it here or you can move it on any new seat and you can hide this now we will select the chart area we will cover the entire chart and we will copy this range and here we will go to the paste special and we will paste as linked picture so we will pay paste as linked picture now we will go to the view and we'll remove the headings grid lines and now we will go to the format under format we will select the picture style so because uh, this graph has been converted into the picture or you can say we have copies the range of the graph and now paste it here as a linked picture so because it is a picture now we are uh, so picture tools is available here we will select the picture style from here which is this one the okay, graph is ready now you can see in place of this simple graph if you will create this graph it will look more beautiful okay friends so that's it. that is how you can create this graph in microsoft excel thank you so much for the watching